we just did a cake for Beyonce, and it was when she was having uh, her twins, we did a, a baby shower for her. Hi, I'm Tom Rosa, owner of Cake and Art here at West Hollywood, California. I wasn't the original in initiator of Cake and Art. That was a gentleman named Glenn Von Kickel. He was an artist and a baker, and in 1976, he decided, I'm gonna meld these two passions of mine into a business. I was introduced to him as a friend of mine who was a very well-known actress came and she said, you gotta meet this crazy guy in West Hollywood. He's got this business and he makes these extraordinary cakes. And Glenn and I hit it off really well. He was uh, 25 years older than me. He was one of these very larger than life characters. He kind of looked like a cross between Peter O'Toole and Richard Harris. He goes, I really need a business partner. I need somebody who can handle the business side of, of this company. And the more I immersed myself in the business, the more it, became, it was this fascinating interplay of art and business. When Cake and Art opened in those first few years, it was still the golden age of Hollywood. So the great actors of that era, the Audrey Hepburns, the Jimmy Stewarts, the Cary Grants, the Lucille Balls, they were all customers and they all lived, you know, a mile or so up the street in Beverly Hills. And these people would walk in and I would go, oh my God, it's Audrey Hepburn. Oh my God, it's Cary Grant. They loved Glenn. They loved the interplay with him. Carrie Fisher was one of our very first celebrities. This was before Star Wars. We've done cakes for her her entire life. When she turned 60, which was a few weeks before she died, she came in and she said, I want to do my 60th birthday cake. And she came back and she was working with us on the cake. And three weeks later, she was gone. And it was like very sad because I literally have known this, her since she was you know, a teenager when she was about to do shampoo up to this stage in her life. And so that kind of had my mortality also as like going, wow. I've had so many staff people from here who've opened bakeries around the world who have been extraordinarily successful, who've got four, five, six bakeries We've had offers from all over the world to open Cake and Arts there. But I love the boutique operation. I love being able to go home at night and going to sleep and not worrying about, you know, what the bakery is doing in Malibu. What's the one doing here? What's the one doing there? But these kids, they've gone on and they have opened these extraordinary bakeries and I'm so proud of them. I just tell them, try not to open a mile away from our business.